Well, this new energy lending policy is going to have uh, a big impact on our, our lending priorities for the future. It's going to mean more lending for energy efficiency projects, such as building renovation. It's going to mean more lending for renewable energy, such as solar and wind power. It's going to mean more lending for higher risk projects, such as uh, uh, clean technology, innovation, battery storage, uh, smart energy systems and so on. It's going to mean more lending for uh, electricity power distribution and transmission and interconnection systems. And obviously what it's going to also mean, which I understand has been the most controversial aspect of this, is that we stop financing unabated uh, fossil fuel projects by the end of 2021. What, what, stepping back, what this really means is that we're setting a standard, and perhaps even a global standard, for what it means to, for a big bank like the EIB to be aligned with the requirements of the Paris Climate Agreement and ambitious EU climate and energy targets.